So for folks who aren't chemists, um, when you say Albert is trained on 15 million uh, molecular structures, what does that actually mean? One of our core beliefs as a company is that you can't just take like off the shelf generic large language models, gen AI, machine learning, whatever, and start applying it to science. I think if that if it was that easy, it would have been done a long time ago. Uh, so what you have to do instead is you have to take advantage of the underlying data that exists out there in the world. And there's basically two forms of data that exists out there. There's the publicly available data. So that's the, the patent landscape, the literature, you know, stuff coming out of academia. And then there's the enterprise data. And our mission at Albert is to help the largest and, and the biggest enterprises take advantage of both of those sources. So the public and the, the private. Uh, so when you mentioned 15 million molecules, it's actually coming from the public space. Uh, there's a lot of publicly available data out there um, put out by government agencies and academia and, and, and the like. Uh, and we build foundational models of chemistry with that public data. 